Hey, you know, I got this Legoland model making video. Want to watch it with me? Yeah, you know, I'm the Lego maniac of the universe. Let's see it. <laughs> It took 30 million Lego bricks to make up the 5,000 models they have at the park. How long did it take to make all those models? Three years, and they built them to last for a long time. Okay, Lego expert. With all these Lego bricks, how do they get from here to here? Let me show you how easy it is. Watch this. Very funny. How do they really make all those great models? Okay, this time I'll really show you. It starts with a lot of planning. He must be a master model builder. That's right. Builders at model shops in Denmark, England, and right here use drawings, plans, photos, and even souvenirs to create the models. What's that? That's a styrofoam model they use to plan where everything goes. The model builders use simple tools like glue, a rubber hammer, and a pair of pliers. I can do that. Glue keeps the model strong and together. This builder is dabbing the bricks in the glue. Maybe I should use glue. But you always want to take yours apart. Yeah, I guess you're right. The model builders built this small prototype of the really big Einstein head. No wonder they say he was a big thinker. The finished model was so big, it had to be split into sections to move it out of the building. This model maker is brushing the glue on. The president's heads from Mount Rushmore are 1 15th the size of the real ones. Each head took over 50,000 bricks and 250 hours to build. That would leave you no time for social studies homework. Look at those drawers with all the Lego pieces. I gotta get mine organized like that. Miniland USA even has a Mardi Gras with costumes and floats, just like the real thing. Holy jambalaya, there is even a paddle steamer that really floats. Ah, the home of the President of the United States, the White House. Right. It has 32,000 bricks and took more than six weeks to complete. Wow, that's almost a whole summer vacation. The Golden Gate Bridge has 75,000 bricks and 100 tiny light bulbs. Talk about attention to detail. Once the models are all finished, they appear at Legoland. Wait a minute. How do they get those models to California? They take the models apart. Wrap them up very carefully. and move them by truck, plane, and train until they arrive at Legoland, California. Now that they're home, the models can be unpacked and set in place. I gotta get some more bricks. of other details to finish. Sounds, lights, animation, and all the landscaping. All those details. Let me see if I get it straight. First they plan the models, then they build, then they ship, then they set the models up for us. We can do that. 
Okay, let's try it ourselves. What do you want to build? How about a life-size limo that really works? What about a nuclear submarine? We could build the Grand Canyon. Let's build the lost city of Atlantis. <laughs>